If you want to lock apps on Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra, the best way to do so is by using the secure folder where you can set up a password and also use biometrics including the fingerprint. In order to set up the secure folder, what you need to do is first of all go to settings. Then in the settings we can scroll down and choose security and privacy. And then over here go to more security settings and then here we will find secure folder. Now I have already set this up, but in your case you should be able to choose the password type that you wish to set up for the secure folder. So here you can choose either of these password types. And after that, once you set it up, you should also be able to use the fingerprint. So as long as you have fingerprint sensor set up, if you have added your fingerprint before, then you can also enable and disable biometrics over here in the secure folder uh, lock type settings. Now the secure folder after that is added to the app screen. So you can tap on the icon in order to add it. And as you can see, I can unlock it with the fingerprint. Here we can add apps that will be locked behind those, um, th this fingerprint and optionally the password as well. Well, not optionally, but password as well. So here we can press this plus button in order to add anything, any app that we wish to use with the uh, fingerprint. However, you need to keep in mind that the app that is added to the secure folder, of course, it has separate data than the same app outside of the secure folder. Meaning that if I add, let's say, WhatsApp over here into the secure folder, in order to unlock it, of course, I need to go to the secure folder and use it over here. Or I can press and hold my finger and add it to the home screen. But the WhatsApp app itself will be also visible over here in the app drawer or home screen. So it does not move the app from the home screen or app drawer into the secure folder, but rather it creates a copy. And still we can use it in order to, um, to set up a password or in this case use the fingerprint in order to create the lock, create the password for the app. And if you don't want to have the access to the main app outside the secure folder, then in that case you can hide it like I have hidden my apps over here as well at this point and in order to hide these apps we can open settings again this time we need to go back and to the main page and we're gonna choose home screen and then in the home screen we can hide apps over here so here we can select apps that will be hidden from the app screen and the home screen uh, but of course those apps that are added in the secure folder are not included in this case so this is how we can access these apps um, by using the fingerprint. And that is pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.